Dear women, marriage does not stop a man from cheating. Most of us thought that when we get married, that automatically makes a man to stop cheating. My name is Mrs. Favor Ime Orun. I am that your number one global family therapist. Why am I here? I'm here to let you know what they will not tell you on pulpits. They hide so many things so that they will not get to lose members. But here, I will bring it down from pulpits and tell you the truth. Anytime you have challenge or problem in your home, in your marriage, you don't know anyone to disclose it with, do well to call my attention. 080 3932 2035. Or you can even call in, send me mail on this platform. I will respond vehemently without words hesitating. Women's Cram Platform at gmail.com. Thank you. Today, I want to let you know one thing, just one thing that makes men to stop cheating. Somebody watching me, you said, I've done all I could. They told me in my church, they told me during marriage council, that if I want to keep a man, things I should do. Now, let me let you know in a very clear way that washing your husband's buzzers cannot make him to stop cheating on you. Cooking for him can't make him to stop cheating on you. Being 100% good woman, I am telling you, can't make him to stop cheating on you. Yes, the earlier you know this, the better for you. The earlier you settle this in your heart, it will make you not to be hot. It will help you to heal. Somebody will say, hey, upon all I did to this man, even if you kill yourself, it can't stop a man from cheating on you. A man that wants to cheat will cheat on you. Even if you kill yourself for that man, no matter your sacrifices, no matter anything, a man that wants to cheat on you, madam, dear women, will still cheat on you. Marriage can't make a man to stop cheating on you. Marriage cannot stop that man. A man that wants to cheat, will cheat. Instead, it will amplify the whole thing. I am here to tell you the right truth. Because I've gotten males, people talking a lot. Of us. I want to let you know that even if you kill yourself, a man, irresponsible man, will still cheat on you. Take it. Or leave it. A man that does not have control over his penis is like a city without a wall. Mm. Men, some men, most men, allow their penis, their manhood, to control them. Mm. But most of them controls their penis, controls their manhood. 
those people are responsible men. What am I trying to say? Most men, they are the one that sends their penis to error. Instead of them sending their penis to an error, their penis sends them to an error. Go. Anybody that is a woman, anybody, anything that is in skates, pursue, take over. Their penis decides for them. They don't decide for their penis. All their lives is in their penis. Yes. That's why I want to tell you today that even if you kill yourself, a man, irresponsible man that wants to cheat will still cheat on you. Get it into your skull. And organize yourself. And think. Plan your life. Now. Before he gets late. Are you listening to me, dear women? Are you hearing what I'm saying? Don't say, upon I establish this man. That is what hurts you. Each time you remember your sacrifices. Each time you remember what you did for that man. And yet, he went at the back to cheat on you. It hurts him. That is why you are killing yourself. But when you understand that money does not make a man to stop cheating, it will help you to heal you know, so that you will not die before your time. If you die, the same so-called man will marry another person. Have you asked yourself questions? Why is it that a man, a woman that carried a baby nine months, the same woman that you fail to take care of, a man doesn't. You cheated on your wife, you are cheating on your wife, you are humiliating the woman, you are de destroying the woman, you are doing a lot of things, beating the woman, treating the woman bad. You are busy pursuing side cheats. You don't give a, a woman attention. Let me leave it. This one is for another day's topic. Okay? Please do not waste your energy saying because I'm married, because he married me. Even if you are still single now, hear what I'm telling you. Settle it in your heart that when you get married, it will never stop a man from cheating on you. You cannot use marriage to tie a man. A man that wants to cheat will cheat. Okay, so please, please, I want to tell you now one thing that makes a man to stop cheating. What is that thing? Fear of God. Fear of God is the only thing that makes a man to stop cheating. Any man that doesn't have God, any man that doesn't fear God, any man that doesn't have God, the person will cheat. Let it get into, into you. It's not all men that cheat. We still have responsible men that they don't cheat, doesn't cheat. They are those people that have fear of God. They have conscience. This fear of God we are talking about is conscience. If any person that if your conscience can't kill you, it can keep you. Do you understand? Any man that has fear of God, that is the only thing that makes a man to stop cheating. One thing I want to tell you today, the only thing that will make your husband to stop cheating on you is if the person has fear of God. That's conscience. Not your, your good woman. Ohala. So always pray. Let God give you a man that fears God. A man that has conscience. Are you getting what I'm saying? I am done with you today. Settle it in your hearts. Do not kill yourself anymore. Do not die because of a man. 
Wipe away your tears. Stop crying because they cheat on, cheated on you. He's not your life. That man is not your life. He's not your future. He's not your destiny. Marriage is not where life ends. So many of us have carried this mentality of marriage is where life ends. No. If God gives you a man that fears him, that is when that man will stop cheating on you. Not by marriage. With these few points, I hope I'm able to gather your sense together. Have I informed you? Or have I misformed you? Put yourself together. Bring your mindset. Bring your perspective concerning marriage together. Know today that it's only a man that fears God that will stop cheating on you. Even if you kill yourself or that one. It's only a man that fears God, that has conscience, that will stop cheating on you. Yes, I said it. You know I can't end this video without letting you know how much I love you. Following me. How much I value you on this platform. Please, do what to extend this love and value by commenting just like share somebody needs to hear this and be delivered from ignorance help and share the video comment let it get to this someone that needs to live above ignorance thank you meet you next time remember I am that your number one family global therapist. The woman that will tell you the truth, they cannot tell you on platform, on, on pulpits. Bye bye. Mm. Love you.